Mob Psycho 100 is one of those anime that everyone loves, and for good reason. This series, despite the weird and crazy art style and wacky story, has something that is relatable to someone. Which is exactly what makes this series so good in the first place. Mob Psycho 100 is my favorite series by the creator one. Now, don't get me wrong, I love One Punch Man, but it doesn't have the same appeal to me that a series like Mob Psycho does. When you watch Mob Psycho, you go into it not really expecting much, but coming out of that experience with a changed perspective on anime. This series breaks a lot of traditional conventions that make up a series and instead tells its unique story in its unique way. Mob Psycho has this way of storytelling that just gets you invested and I think that mostly shows in the way that this series uses all of its elements seamlessly. Its characters, its art style, its music, and even its animation, all of it comes together seamlessly to make the anime so much fun. The comedy in this series hits on a different level as well. This series mixes comedy with action and serious moments perfectly that makes it flow really well and it doesn't make the comedy cringe either, like in a lot of other anime. I find myself laughing out loud quite a lot when I watch this series, which I don't find myself doing too often when I watch anime anymore. Mob Psycho 100 is this perfect blend of everything you look for in a good anime. It makes up for its shortcomings by being funny and having great animation. This series is also great for making people reflect on themselves through the actions of the characters, which is something that makes this series so incredible. If you, for whatever reason, have been living under a rock for the past few years and haven't watched this anime, then I highly recommend that you give it a shot, as this series has a lot of amazing elements, although it can certainly be a little slow at times. Before we continue this video, it would be awesome if you can leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel. I make new anime and manga content every single week on a variety of different series and topics. The characters in Mob Psycho are arguably the biggest thing that makes this series so incredible and beloved by so many people. Mob as a protagonist is honestly just incredible. He is extremely relatable in so many different ways. He is at the age where so many kids are told that they have to start figuring out what they want to do in life. He is also at the age where he starts to fall in love for the first time, and we get to see how all of that stuff affects Mob. He works on improving himself so he can love himself, which I think is a message everyone needs to take away from this series and Mob. Reagan is one of the best mentor characters in all of anime. Is he a good person? No, definitely not, but no one claims he is. However, he is a great mentor for Mob. He cares about Mob and wants to see him do his best and achieve great things, and he does his best to guide Mob in the best way he can with all the knowledge he has. But the biggest thing that I love about Reagan is that he not only teaches Mob, but he also learns from Mob. Both of them help each other to become better people, and the relationship between Mob and Reagan is super awesome to see develop. Besides just those two, the other characters are also pretty good. Each one of them has a unique personality that makes them stand out, and a lot of the characters also get a lot of development, so they don't stay stagnant. All of the characters feel like real people living in this crazy world with psychics and yokai. The characters are all hilarious as well. Each one of them brings their own types of jokes to the table that makes them stand out. Every one of them is able to be laughed at and with without it coming off as mean or anything, and the way that the series is able to portray the friendships between certain characters through comedy is honestly just kind of impressive. However, the comedy isn't the only thing that makes these characters so awesome. The relatability of the characters is another one of the best things about Mob Psycho and is the biggest reason why I and so many other people will continuously recommend this series to people. Because there is something about this series that just draws you in, and I think personally that the biggest thing is the characters with how compelling, interesting, and funny all of them are. The animation in Mob Psycho is next level. Of course, I think everyone already knows that, but this series actually does look incredible. When there is a massive fight going on, you can count on Mob Psycho to look amazing. I mean, look at the final fight in Season 2, or the fight against Hanizawa. Both of the fights look insane. The art style in Mob Psycho is also great. The anime takes the manga's art style and runs with it, refining it a little but keeping the overall style the same. This allows for all the moments to hit just as hard, if not more so, than the original manga series. The art style allows for the animators to play with the expressions of the characters, and it really brings out the comedy and the wackiness of the series. I know that the art style can definitely put some people off from this series, but honestly, to me, as I have already explained, I think it enhances everything about this series tenfold. The music in Mob Psycho is also really good. The OPs are insane. The first two are really amazing, and the most recent third one is still pretty good. But the OST for this series is where it really shines through. The music plays at all the right times, and it has a wide variety of tracks to fit the moment from somber to action-packed to comedic and everything in between. The music enhances what was already there in the original work by a great deal and really makes this series work so well in anime form. Mob Psycho 100 is one of those anime that just took over the community. Everyone was excited at the announcement for Season 3, and so far it has delivered on all the things we love for Mob. This series has a way of drawing everybody into its narrative without it being too flashy or off-putting, which is awesome. 
Mob Psycho 100 is one of the best anime released in the 2010s for its compelling characters, interesting narrative, and fun and wacky setting. 